Oh, no, wait a minute. Okay. I use that for Hello everyone, hello, hello. Happy Wednesday. No. This, no, this is Thursday. Happy Thursday evening, everyone. How y'all doing? How's everyone doing? Hello, hello everyone. Hi, everyone. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Well, our weather was one weird weather day today. I didn't wash my hair yet. I got to wash it tonight. So it'll be clean for the weekend. It'll be clean for the weekend. It right. This is one weird weather day. It snowed and then it stopped. No, first the sun came out and then it started snowing again and then the snow stopped and then the sun comes out again. <laughs> the weather was back and forth, back and forth. Oh my gosh.
Just wait for some people to come in before I start chatting. Before I start chatting. Three and three. Hello, everyone. Waiting for people to come on. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. It is now 8.55, almost 9 o'clock. Almost nine o'clock. <clears throat> Hey, 
hi, Eric. How you doing? Thank you for coming in, Eric. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Happy Thursday evening. How was your day? I just stayed in, did some knitting, and strolling on the phone, <laughs> on Facebook, and watching YouTube, watching all my videos, had some coffee. Oh, excuse me. I am well. Had a great day. Was to work. Or, oh, that's that's cool, Eric. Right on. That's cool. Yeah. I wanted to go to my brother's house today, but it was kind of snowy and wetty. Snowy and wet. <laughs> How's your weather there today, Eric? I want to go for a walk. I'm waiting for the weather to be better. Oh, man, weather to be better. I miss the fresh air, Eric. Hold on. I'll be right back. I got to go get my phone. Sunny but raining. Okay. Hi, Jason. Oh, sunny but raining. Rain is coming. Okay. We had rain the other day, Eric. Hi, Jason Bender. How you doing? Welcome in. Welcome, Jason. Jason, meet my friend Eric. Eric, meet Jason. Good afternoon, my friends, from Peterborough, Ontario. Oh, you're in Canada too, Jason. I didn't realize that. I sub to your channel, Jason. Ontario, Canada. Send May the 1st. Pat Boone is going to be singing gospel music. Well, yes, I remember Pat Boone. Oh, he was a lovely singer, Jason. I remember him, Jason. Mr. Pat Boone. Pat Boone. Patrick Boone. Yeah, he was a great singer, Jason. Yeah, he was. Yeah, he was really good. What was his number one big hit, Jason? I can't remember now. There was one song I liked of him, but I can't remember. Pat Boone. I, I, oh, I can't remember. I'll be right back, guys. Right back. I can't remember. Pat Boone. There. They're saying we're going to have. No way. You guys are having snow in Ontario? My parents. Oh, your parents are in Wisconsin. That's right. Friends in Canada. Just visiting friends in Canada. Yeah, that's right. I forgot, Jason. Sorry about that. How's it going? You having a good time, Jason? Yeah, you're just visiting in Canada. That's right, too, Jason. Now, thanks for refreshing my memory, Jason. I hope you're having a good time. Pat Boone, I want to see what his... What was Pat Boone's number one song? Pat Boone. 
number one hits, ain't that a shame, I almost lost my mind, don't forbid me, love letters in the sand, April love, and Moody River. Oh, Mo Moody River. Oh, there they are, Jason. There's all his hit songs, Jason. Pat Boom. Ain't that a shame? I'll be home. I'll be home reached number one, Jason. Number one song. 1978 was somewhere over the rainbow. Yes, I thought so, Jason. Thank you. Somewhere over the rainbow. Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is, yeah. That's what it is, Jason. Thank you. Minus two right now, guys. Hey, guys, look it. Minus two in St. John. Oh, excuse me. Minus two, guys. Yeah. Do you get lots of snow where you are, Eric? We didn't have snow all March until now. That's weird. <laughs> That's the weather for you. Nice one minute. You don't know the next minute. <laughs> Yeah. Dump of snow this season. Spring Bridge. Spring Bridge. The Spring Bridge. My friend from Peterborough said, if I behave myself tonight, they're going to take me and go see Niagara Oh, Jason, that's beautiful. I'd love to see Niagara Falls and the Northern Lights. Is that where the Northern Lights are, Jason? I can't remember. What place? Where is the Northern Lights at? I can't remember now. Northern Lights. The Northern Lights. The Northern Lights. I can't remember. Niagara Falls. Wow. Five places, there's five places where the northern lights are. Not just one, five places. Oh, I love the northern lights, Jason. They are so awesome. They are so awesome. Five places in Canada. All in Canada. Arctic Circle. One one is an Arctic Circle, Jason. Where's the other ones at? Arctic Circle. Look at that, Jason. Oh, it's ever cool. Arctic lights. And if you venture, you don't have to venture into the wilderness. I thought the northern lights were in Texas. Yeah. I'm not sure about that, Jason. I'll have to look that up. Or you should look it up, Jason. No, I don't know. I thought they were Canada lights, Canadian lights. Or they're in USA. I'm not sure. No, it says only in Canada. I think it's only in Canada, Jason. 
I thought the Northern Lights were in Texas. Are you celebrating Easter? April is coming. We are Easter is April the 28th or March the 28th, Jason. We have a supper. We have a nice Easter supper and exchange chocolate. Me and my brother and his girlfriend. Oh, yellow knife. Yellow knife, Jason. Look it. Look at that, Jason. Yellow knife, northern. Northern territories. Northern territories. The place where skyscrapers meet the stores of Great Slave Lake, Yellow Knife, is the capital of the North, Northwest Territories of one of Canada's most remote and fascinating region. The lively city also claims to be one of the few places that were in the Northern Lights dance almost every night of the year. Take, take it in the green and red hue swirls with one of the many top tour operators or simply by strolling downtown. Yeah, it's in now. Yeah, Ranch Lake, Ranch, Range, Range Lake. There's a trail. If you, if you're hardly enough to brave the coal, if you're hardy enough to brave, brave the coal, the remote community is equality in, can't say that word, must visit. The lack of light populate pollution in the area means that the natural pneumonia of the lights are even more visible, making for the one of a lifetime experience for seasons and winter explorers. Oh, they're in Ontario too, Jason. Look, Jason, they're in Ontario too. Northern Lights, Ontario. Look at that. Northern Lights, Ontario. Gosh, I'd like to see that in person. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Hi, guitar guy. Hello, Todd. Anywhere in the Northern Hampshire. Okay, cool. Thank you for telling me, Todd. Welcome in. Welcome in. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Have you ever seen the Northern Lights? I'd love to, Todd. Oh, my gosh. That would be amazing. That would be amazing, Todd. Jason says when you go when you go out at night to the to the to take a walk, make sure you wear all yellow and orange so the drivers can see you and wear all the yellow so that drivers can see me. I love Oh, definitely, Jason. But I don't go out at night. No, I stay in. I do not go out at night. Nope. I don't go walking in the night. Hey, Jason, pray. I go a walking after midnight, searching for you. Sing that one, Jason. I think I'm going to make a toast fried egg sandwich. Right off. I just had a English muffin, and I had a couple of pancakes with syrup on it. And now I'm drinking water. I like Big 8 water. Hey, J uh, Todd, do you guys have that brand in PEI? Big 8? I'll never drink our tap. Oh, Todd, speaking of water, Todd, is your water good to drink there? Yep, cool. Is your tap water good to drink? Big 8, yeah, my favorite. I've been, oh, it is. Okay, cool. Thank you for telling me. My brother's girlfriend, Ruthie, she said, it's all right. It's all in your mind. I still can't drink it, Todd. I can't drink the tap water, Todd. I can't bring myself to do it. It's too gross. It's too gross, Todd. Hi, Adrian. How you doing, buddy? Hi, Adrian. Adrian is in the house. How you doing, Adrian? I can't drink our tap water. I will not drink it. No, it's got to be store-bought. And then Ruthie says, well, how you know the one in the store isn't tap water? Well, it may be, but it's all purified, Todd. 
It's all purified. It's purified water in the store, right, Todd? How you doing, Adrian? How you doing? How was your day? How was your day? I just puttered around and watched. I watched Todd on his live show. I missed it. I are you going live tomorrow, Todd? I'll try to get up a little earlier. I slept in at two o'clock today, Todd. I overslept today. Darn it! Yeah. Yep. I overslept today. Hey, Todd, do you believe about the comet in the sky? Do you believe that, Todd? Look it. Look, Todd. The comet. The devil's comet visible in the night sky. Won't be swinged by Earth again for decades. I love stuff like that, Todd. I'm so fascinated by it. Oh, I'll show you my Maxwell house, Todd. Hold on. Hold on, Todd. Hold the line. Hold the line. There, Todd. I had a cup of it earlier. Maxwell House. With Maxwell House. Oh, my God. Oh, I got that much left. Maxwell House. I had a cup of it earlier. Today was pretty good. Jason says, that was... Oh, right, right, Todd. Or, uh, right, Jason. You, right. I forgot. That was Patsy Klein. Thank you, Jason, for reminding me. I go a walking after midnight searching for you. Yeah, I heard that too, Jason. A lot of singers have died in, in plane crashes. Very sad, isn't it, Jason? So many sing. Look at John Denver. He died in a plane crash. Remember, Jason? What year did John Denver pass away? You remember John De uh, John Denver, Todd? Oh, yeah, you sing Country Roads, Take Me Home. John Denver sings that, too. Yeah, John Denver. Eighteen years ago for Patsy Klein, nineteen sixty one. Oh, okay. Oh, John Denver died October the twelfth, nineteen ninety seven. John Denver, Jason. John Denver. He died where? In Mexico. He was He died in Mexico. The plane went down in California. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. He was a good singer, too, Jason. Yeah. John Denver. Take me home, country roads, to the place I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama. He was 53 when he passed away. Age of death, 53, Jason. 53 years old. Way younger than me. <clears throat> Oh, 
Oh, I love I love it, Todd, when you sing that country road song. Your voice is so soft and smooth. I got Maxwell House, but it's in a green bottle. It says, good to the last drop. Oh, yeah. I remember that saying, 1956. Good to the last drop. Yep. I think I had this one since last year. Coffee never goes bad. All it does, it gets hard. Hey, you notice that, guys? Coffee will not go bad, but if you keep it for a few years, it actually gets hard. The coffee gets hard. Because I had a coffee get right hard. I had to throw it out. Oh, my gosh. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. Okay, it came in a green bottle. Yeah. I like to try Folgers again, too. I, I like to try Folgers coffee again, Jason. Yeah, Folgers coffee. I got six folks out there and eight thumbs up. Thank you, everyone. I got eight thumbs up. Yeah. Yeah. So what's your plans for the weekend? Or, yeah, you got, you're busy with friends. I don't know what I'm doing yet. Oh, I want to see what tomorrow's weather is. The singer Ricky Nelson. Oh, I don't remember him, Ricky Nelson. I, honest to God, I don't, I don't remember him. The singer Ricky Nelson died in the... See? All the singers passed away in the airplane. 1985. Do you remember Ozzy and Harry? I remember that name, Ozzy and Harriet. Yes, a TV show. Yes, yes. I do, Jason. Ozzy and Harriet, but I never watched. I wasn't into it, though. But I know the name. Oh, yeah, I know it. Yes, sir. I know the name. Yep, Hawsey and Harriet. Harriet. Yeah. Didn't they didn't they have a comedy show, Jason? I think they had a comedy show. I'm gonna look up Ricky Nelson. R I C K I. There he is, Ricky Nelson. Oh yeah, there he is, Ricky Nelson. He, uh, what? he died December 31st, 1985, Jason. Ricky Nelson. What kind of songs did he sing? Poor Little Fool, It's Up to You. Tra Traveling Man, I Will Follow You. Lonesome Town, Hello Mary Lou. Goodbye, heart. Oh, I remember that song. Hello, Mary Lou. Goodbye, heart. Remember that one, Jason? It's up to you. Garden Party, 1972. Never be anyone else but you. A teenage romance. It's late. My rifle. My rifle, my pony, and me. Cindy. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's who he is. Okay. Hey, Google, what's the weather like for St. John, New Brunswick, Canada, tomorrow, Friday? It's going to be sunny tomorrow. I might be able to go for my walk, Jason. I got my, I got something for my brother's girlfriend. I got her some chocolates. I got to go out and get my brother some chocolate for Easter. Because he's a chocolate lover, Jason. Where there's chocolate, Pat is sure to be there. 
It's going to be sunny tomorrow, sunny and cloudy, March the 22. And this is the weather for all next week, guys. Oh, we're going to have good weather all week. No, I spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. Tuesday. Sunny Tuesday. Ah, dang it. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So that Friday, not, oh, is it this Friday or following Friday, I think. Following Friday. Where's Jaina? Come on in, Jaina. Are you out there? Shelly Sanders. I got Shelly Sanders back on my video channel. I got her back on. I just had to put unhide, unhide her. So I unhide her, she can come in. Oh, yuck. Toby Keith, John Arsenal, and James Burton reveal the Country Music Hall of Fame 2024 inductees. The Billboard's Award. Oh, I like that group, Air Supply. Lost in love, I'm so lost without you. What am I without you? I'm so lost without you. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Big prices hikes expected at New Brunswick fuel pumps. Look at this, guys. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Big prices hikes expect at New Brunswick fuel pumps. What else is new, right, Jason? What else is new? I don't know. You tell me what else is new. What else? Country Rose is on my mind now, Todd. I can hear Country Rose in my mind. Country Rose, take me home to the place. I belong, West Virginia. Mountain Mama, take me home down Country Rose. Are you on, Jane? Yeah, where's Jane? Where's Jane? I'll, I don't know if she's busy or not. Hey, Jay McNelty, where are you? I'm on. Come on in, my dear friend. Jay McNelty. Yeah. You tell her, Jason, where is she? Take me home, country roads, to the place I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama. Take me home, down country roads. I hear her voice in the morning as she calls me. The radio reminds me of my home, far away. And driving down the road, I get a feeling that I should have been there yesterday. Yesterday, country roads, take me home to the place. I belong, West Virginia, Mount Mama, take me home down country roads. She might be sleeping now, Jason, I don't know. Sometimes she has naps, or she could be busy with her son, too. 
Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, I pressed the wrong one. Down country roads, take. Todd, you got me singing that now, Todd. <laughs> Now country roads. Hey Todd, I'd like to hear you sing Elvis Presley, um, Suspicious Minds. Oh Todd, I'd love for you to sing that one, Todd. Do you still have the professional baseball team in Canada? Ah. Oh, Toronto Blue Jays. Oh, I, they're my favorite. Yes. Yes, Jason. I always went for Toronto Blue Jays. Yeah, they were my favorite and they still are. I remember my late brother. He used to go for um all the other USA teams. And whenever my team won, Jason, he'd get mad. Jason, he would get so mad. Sparkle is in the house. Hi, Sparkles. How you doing? Happy Thursday evening. Welcome, welcome. Welcome. Welcome in, Sparkles. Jason's been asking about you, Sparkles. You missed it. You're well missed, Sparkle. Yes, Sparkle's in the house. Sparkles in the house. How was your day, Sparkles? How you doing? Sparkle is in the house. Greetings, Sparkles. Yes, welcome in, Sparkles. How was your day? How was your day? How was your day? Oh, look it. There's my friend and their dog, Sparkles. That That's my uh, Ruth, Ruthie's grandson. That's Ruthie's grandson with their little doggy, Thor. His name is Thor. He's a chocolate lab. He's so cute, isn't he, Jason? He's a chocolate lab, Jason. Aw. He's so pretty. Aw. Yeah. So cute. I like chocolate labs. You know how much she spent for him, guys? My brother's girlfriend's daughter, she spent near $2,000 for the chocolate lab. Oh, my gosh. Someone wanted her dog, right? And she said, I'm not giving my dog away. Oh, my God, guys. $2,000 for a chocolate lab. What? Oh, my gosh. Oh, come on, shut off already. <laughs> Darn phone wouldn't shut off. But chocolate lamps are so beautiful. I love them. 
I love her doggy. I can't wait to go see him again. <laughs> he, when we play cards in the kitchen, Jason and Sparkles, he sits there and watches us. So cute, guys. It is so adorable. He's getting heavy, too, guys. Oh, man, he's such a dear. Yep. Chocolate labs are so pretty. And their fur is so soft, too, guys. Yep. How you doing, Sparkles? Country roads take me home to the place I belong. West Virginia, mountain mama, take me home down country roads. I hear her voice in the morning as she calls me. The radio reminds me of my home far away. And driving down the road, I get a feeling that I should have been home yesterday. Yesterday, country roads take me home to the place I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama, take me home down country roads. Do, 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 bum, 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 Oh, I better charge my laptop up. I almost called my laptop a tablet. I got to charge this up, guys. I'm, I'm from Fond du Lac. Fond du Lac. Yeah, Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. Good old USA, Wisconsin. I live by myself. Me too. I prefer to live by myself, Jason. I prefer, I love being by myself. I don't feel lonesome. I got, I got my friends. I got my family. I got my, all my letters to write to. I got my YouTube videos. I'm never lonely. I love it. I love it. I've been on my own now since I was 26 years old, Jason. Because I knew my mom was dying and I didn't want to be alone. And I didn't want to be in the house with all the boys and no mom, right? It would have been hard to get over. But I learned to cope with it. Oh, thank you, Sparkles. I hope you do, too. I hope you do as well, Sparkles. Yeah, I lost my mom when I was 26 years old. In 1994, I was 26 years old. Oh my gosh, if I could bring back that time. If I could bring back those days, I would, I would love it. I would do things all over again, but in a better way. Yeah. Oh, Sparkles, look at all my birthday cards in the balloon. Those Sparkles. And I, someone, one of my friends in Pen Pal gave me a, a necklace set. <laughs> All my birthday cards and balloons. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Spark. You mean my eyeshadow? I got pink eyeshadow on. Oh, thank you. You saw it. Yeah. Love 
I don't wear much eye, much makeup, but I do love eyeshadow and lip gloss. I like eyeshadow and lip gloss. I'll show you what my friend sent me in the mail. Look at this, guys. Hold on a minute. Look, look what my friend sent me today in the mail. Look at these. If I can show them. She gave me a pair of earrings. There are butterflies on them. Oh, I can't... There. She gave me a pair of earrings. I know I do too. There they I'm trying to show them better. There they are. She gave me them. Aren't they gorgeous? I love them. And and she also gave me she also gave me a bracelet to match. Look at it. A bracelet to match it. Look, a bracelet to match. And, and she gave me a necklace too. Look at this. Oh, is it ever beautiful? Oh my gosh, I'm going to send her a nice, I do. Oh, I also like dragonflies too, Sparkles. I love dragonflies. Oh, my God, they're beautiful. Yeah, look at this. Yeah. They are beautiful. Yeah, she's a beautiful friend. Yeah, I can't wait to send her a nice thank you card. Yeah. I love the bracelet. Oh, my gosh. I'll put it on tomorrow for tomorrow's video. Because I'm getting ready to get a shower. And look what else she sent me. Oh, wait, I'll take it out. I'll take it out. She sent me this pen. Look at that. A cure. There we go. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. Breast cancer awareness. Yes. Yeah. I had my mammogram. I had my mammogram last year, so I don't have to go till next year. Yeah. I don't have to go till next year. I'm going to put this jewelry on tomorrow for my video. Yeah, such a beautiful set. Oh, my gosh. I just love it. Oh, my gosh. I just love it. Hey, Sparkle, is it, this is true what they say. Jewelry, jewelry is a girl's best friend. Jewelry can't hurt you, right, Sparkles? I mean, diamonds are, I say jewelry is a girl's best friend. Yeah, it's a girl's best friend because it can't hurt your feelings. Just makes you feel good, right, Sparkles? Yeah, makes you feel good. Makes you feel good. Of course, you best part. Oh, she sent me these stickers, too. Look at Sparkles. Look at the stickers. Oh, they gorgeous. Look. Look at the big one right there. Look at that one. I might put one on my laptop on the back. Yeah, they are, aren't they? I like the I like the yellow one. Look at that one right there. I like the yellow one. I like them all. They're so pretty. They're so pretty, sparkles. I love dragonflies, butterflies. And this is a card she sent me. 
she sent me this card look at that look at all the light bulbs on it or no they might be balloons look at that chocolate cake look at that chocolate cake guys oh i got be real beautiful friends i'm telling you we're lifelong friends too sparkles and you're one of my new friends too sparkles you're also in, on my friends list too sparkles are you on facebook i'd like to add you if you are or you can add me i'm always willing to make friends oh she's she's great i was so shocked i was just waiting for a letter i wasn't expecting all that a letter would have been good oh my gosh i'm telling you oh i know sparkles oh my gosh it gives you a beautiful feeling knowing someone wants to write to you sparkles hey believe it or not sparkles i've been a pen pal since the 80s and 90s and i still write to some of them today i still write to some of them today i just love it i just love oh my god the other day i went to open my mailbox sparkle and the letters all flew on the floor one fell right on the floor oh it made my day i was so happy i was so happy sparkle yeah it is yeah it is letters are always nice to receive and to send yes for sure sparkles I, I I stopped doing it for a while. I don't know what happened to me. I wasn't stressed or nothing. I just had to stop for a while. And then all of a sudden, I got right back into it, full swing. I'm glad. Because when I, when I watch all oh, Me Too, yeah, Me Too Sparkles, when I watch all my soaps and videos on YouTube, I'm always writing a letter. I just can't sit there and watch TV. I got to be doing something. You know what I mean? You got to be doing something while you're watching TV. I just can't sit there, do nothing. I got to do something. Yeah. Keep my hands busy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I'm looking at the jewelry right now. It's so beautiful. Oh, yes, yeah, true. I like multitask. Some, yeah, me, that's the way I am, too. That's the way I am, too, Sparkles. When I was in third grade, 1982, we used to learn how to write cursive. Oh, yeah, like like this here. Like this here, Jason. Like that, right, Jason? Like that, right, Jason? Yeah, curvy. Like that, right? People, I used to love writing letters to celebrities. Oh, I wrote to celebrities too back then. And they would actually send me the picture while the office did. You remember Santa Barbara, Abe Martinez? He, the, His office sent me a picture of him. I was so hung up on him back then. He's 75 today. Holy moly. He played on Santa Barbara. And then he went back on Days of Our Lives for a while. And then he had his own show on the weekend. I forget what it was called now. I forget what it was called now. Dang. Yeah. Oh, I also wrote to Ann Murray too, Jason. And they sent me a picture of her, her too. But I lost them. That was years ago. I lost them all, Jason. I wish I didn't. Oh, man. I could have showed you all today. Oh. Yeah. I wonder if you can still write to soap opera stars today. I get those soap opera digests and they have the addresses in there of each soap operas. The soap opera digest. Yeah. I like to I like to write to Ridge on Bold and the Beautiful. Oh my god, he's gorgeous. Ridge. Ridge Forrester. 
I'm bold and beautiful. Oh my gosh. Don't tell my favorite singer, Cheyenne. <laughs> yep. Ten thumbs up now. Hi, everyone. Hello, hello. How you doing? I am doing wonderful. I am doing super good. It's windy out tonight, guys. I don't have the heat on. I don't think I have the heat on. Let me check. Nope, the heat's off. The heat is off. The heat is off. I don't need the heat on tonight. It's just right. It's just perfect. And it's just perfecto, perfecto, perfecto mundo. Okay, that one's answered. Is that one answered? Oh, this one's on. Okay. You're welcome. Holy gosh, it didn't take long for my phone to charge. Look at my phone. The last time I saw it, it was 30. Now it's 86. 86, my phone is. Oh, Myron Kelly. Myron Kelly liked one of my, liked one of my comments. Thank you, Myron. Hi, Myron out there. I'm so glad I found his show. I love his show. Thank you for liking my comment, Myron. Thank you for the thumbs up. I on Jason's allowed back in my channel. Jason, the uh, one in PEI. I add him back on to my channel. Welcome to come in if you like. No, not.
yes, Days of Our Lives used to come on at, on at noon. Oh, I never knew it came on at noon. Eric said Christmas cards are always important. Yes, they are, Eric. I save all my cards that I get, Eric. I keep them for a long time. I don't throw them out. I just put them in the in my one of my bureau drawers. Jason said, yes, Days of Our Lives used to come on at noon with Deidre Hall. You remember? Yeah, she's Dr. Evans. She's still on there, Jason. Marlena is still on there. I still watch Days of Our Lives. I've been watching that since the 80s. Are you watching it lately, Jason? Sparkles in again. Hi, Sparkles. Hello, hello. A lot of bugs came alive today. Oh, Sparkles. Oh. I saw wops. Oh, my gosh, Sparkles. I can't stand those bugs. They're so annoying, especially the horse flies. You know the horse flies? The big black ones? Oh, my God, they're so annoying, bugs. The only bugs I like are ladybugs, Sparkle. They are so cute, aren't they? You like ladybugs, Sparkles? Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, cool. Thanks. They're not home right yet. All those wops. I think I see one maybe last year. They go around the lights a lot, don't they, Sparkles? They go around by the lights. When the water comes, it brings out the bugs. Oh, I can't stand hornets. I can't stand bumblebees. I run away from them. When I see them, I, I, oh, I get so panicky. I can't stand them bugs. I don't mind spiders. I'm not as scared of them. It's a darn uh, hornets. The, the hornets and the bumblebees. Ooh. God. Can't stand them buggers. I can unplug it now. I can unplug the phone. I unplugged the phone. Oh, look at this, guys. Oh, look at this pretty picture, guys. Oh, is that ever pretty? Pretty. There's nothing worse than when hornets try to build a nest near your home. Yeah, I know. I know, Sparkles. Oh, my goodness. Oh, they're creepy colors. I can't stand them. Yeah. I don't want to. Look at that. We were just speaking of northern lights. And here, here they are on my Facebook. The northern lights. Oh, wow. Northern Lights. Yeah. Yeah, I know, Sparkles. That's scary. It is scary.
Yeah. I guess Jane's not coming in tonight, Jason. I think Jane might be uh, busy with her son. She might be busy. What? No way. Oh, it's going to be warmer tomorrow. Sparkles, it's going to be warmer tomorrow. Look at this. One tomorrow, two. Warmer than today. Warmer tomorrow. Uh, I hope so. You better not be lying to me. <laughs> yes, spring is here. Right on, Sparkles. Oh, finally. I can't wait to... Do a lot of walking around this street. I sit down too much, LOL. I'm always sitting down. I got to get out and walk. Yeah, I got to get out and walk, man. You got to do some walking. Oh, my gosh. That one is unreal. Oh, my gosh. Totally unreal. Yeah, can't wait, I can't wait, I can't wait to get out and walk tomorrow. I should walk for a half an hour or an hour? No, I should start a half an hour. I'm going to time it. I'm not kidding, neither. I got to get out there and walk. Fresh air. I got to get some fresh air on my face. Jason Sparkle, that may be spring, Wisconsin, but predicting they have six in by Friday morning, I guess. I'll have to watch and kill the about the year 1999. Then you are God bless. Ah, Jason. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, my gosh. Yeah. I love watching hairstyle videos, little sparkles. Watch how she does her style. I love watching them. I wish it was snow year. Yeah. Oh, you like the snow, do you? They make it look so easy, I know, right? But when I go to try it, I'm always saying, you know what I mean? Like, you get right mad, you can't do it. <laughs> you get right mad and you can't do it, Sparkles. Well, I can't do nothing yet until my hair gets longer. Yeah. I look for short hairstyles. I look for the shorter ones. Short. Short hairstyles.
Yeah. I like the chiffon look. I like that look right there, Sparkles. You call that the chiffon look. And her hair is the same length as mine. Look. I love that style. I just love that style right there. The chiffon look. I love it. Why do you guys make your hairstyle look so easy? <laughs> it's so easy. It's so easy to fall in love. It's so easy. Gal sings that song at our local pub. It's so easy. It's so easy. Fall in love. It's so easy to fall in love. And I always say, no, it ain't. <laughs> It's so easy to fall in love. It's so easy to fall in love. Oh, look at this one. Look at this short hairstyle. Now, look at that one. Look at this. You think I can do that? Not. Oh, look at that, Sparkles. Oh, I love that. It's so pretty. You know what my mom used to do to my hair? She put them both in braids, right? And then she tied it in the back, right? And put them like a crisscross. My mom used to do that to my hair. When we had a country home in the summer, way back in the 70s. It might be easier to have some. Yes, it would. it would be Sparkles. It would be for sure. It would be for sure. Yeah. I like this one, Sparkles. Where do you see this one? Where do you see that one? I never had those picks in my hair yet. Wait till you see what she does with this one. Well, come on already. She was doing a hairstyle. Oh, gosh. It didn't show it again. Yeah, they make everything look so easy. Not. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah. I got 12 thumbs up tonight. Thank you, everyone. 12 thumbs up. Hooray. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 12 thumbs up. And I'm almost done a whole bottle of water. There, that was good. Good bottle of water. Yep. I'm going to stay on for a few more minutes. 10.05, that's not too bad. Jane couldn't come in tonight. She's probably having it. She's probably sleeping or not feeling good. My friend Jane Sparkles. Sometimes she has her real good days and other times she doesn't, right? I feel so bad for Jane going through all that health issue. My gosh. 
Jane, I hope you're okay, Jane. I hope Jane feels... Oh, one time she told me she kept throwing up and she couldn't stop sparkles. Because it was one of the pills that her doctor gave her for anxiety. And he told her he, she had to keep taking them. But why, though? If it makes her throw up, can't they try her on another one? It only makes her throw up. I don't understand. I guess she has to take them, right? I mean, they're for her nerves, her anxiety. Medicine can be complicated. Yes, it can. Yes, it can, Sparkle. Yeah. I'm seeing it now with Jane. Oh, the first time I knew Jane was back in 94, Sparkle. She was super healthy, Sparkles. She was super healthy. And we just many. So we didn't see each other since 30 years, right? We met up last summer or the summer before in the mall, and we got reconnected, Sparkles. It was so much fun seeing her after all these years. She noticed me, but I couldn't. Ha I had a hard time placing her. I felt bad she noticed me first. I didn't recognize her at all. But I was up to her place since then. She has nine beautiful cats. She has a beautiful home. She keeps a nice, clean home, Sparkles. I can't wait to go see her again. We're going to do a video. We're going to do a video. Yeah. She has two beautiful granddaughters, too. Young girls. Oh, shoot. I don't need that one. Ow! I made a mistake on that page. Yeah, it can be. I wonder if I can throw it in the garbage. Am I a good shot? Let's see if I can throw it in. Ready? Two, three. Oh! <laughs> I missed it. I missed it, guys. I couldn't get it in. Dang it. Nice try, though. Nice try.
Ah, dang. Kim, I think I think those paintings behind you are very nice. Oh, thank you. Yeah, those ones right there. Oh, I got them in the store, and that's and that's one of my diamond painting there. See that one there? Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Yeah, I did. That's a diamond painting. Yeah. Oh, uh, thank you, Sparkles. I like that. I'm trying to figure out what to do for a background. Um, like background decorations. I'm thinking of changing it. I don't. I had those pictures there a long time. I had those pictures there for a long, long time. Yeah, but they are pretty and they're colorful. I'm glad you like them, Sparkles. I like decorations. Yeah, I like decorations. It's always fun to decorate, right? Makes you feel good. Yeah. Yes, they they are nice decorations on the, on the wall. Thank you, Sparkles. Thank you very much. I got some pictures and stuff on here, on this wall. On this wall here, Sparkles. I got some decor. I left that up for a long time, the Christmas one. And then I got... I got a picture. There's some decorations there on the wall. I got a picture of Celine Dion up there. It's way up there. Yeah. You should see my bedroom. I got flowers all over the wall in my bedroom. Yeah, I like Celine too, yeah. Oh, she's way up there on the wall. <laughs> yeah, does she? she I feel bad for her health, though. She, I don't think she can sing too much today. Yeah, she's going through a lot of health issues, isn't she? It's very sad about Celine. Yeah, very sad about Celine. She has that muscle uh, muscle problem. What is it called now? Where her muscles are very fatigued? I can't remember that now. Yeah, Celine Dion. Yeah. I love I loved that song called Her My Heart Will Go On. My heart will go on and on. Every night in my dreams, I feel you. I see you. That is how I know you go on. Every night in my dreams. Yes. Oh, I love that too. It's all coming back to me now. It's all coming back. I love that one too, Sparkles. Yep. I had her CD before, but now I listen to the music all on YouTube. I listen to it all on YouTube now. I don't go out and get CDs and all that anymore. CDs are no good with me because I play the song over and over, right? And then it skip the CD starts skipping. <laughs> the CD starts skipping. Thank you for the hearts. Who's ever given me a heart? Here's some for you. Here's some for you. Yep. Celine Dion. Yeah. Her she's getting lower in weight. She's she's getting underweight, Sparkles. Celine Dion. 
I'll bring her up. My heart will go on and on. Every night I see you, I feel you. Yes, it is. Yeah, it really is. Yeah. It really is. Celine Dion, Canadian singer. Yeah. It really is. She's 55 years old today, Sparkles. Yeah. No. She lost a lot of weight. Is that her there? She looks different there, uh, Sparkles. Look at her. She got a new look there. That's a different look. Yeah, what was her health condition again? Yeah, yeah. Look at her dress there. Look. Look at that one. 55 years old. When's her birthday? Her birthday is March the 30th. That's what it is, syndrome. That's what it is. That's what it is, a skin, yeah, that's what it is, syndrome, yeah. Her birthday's in March too, Sparkles, age 55, March 30th, 1968, yeah. I wonder how old her boys are now, yeah. Stuff pars, uh, yeah, stiff. Yeah, her bones are stiff. Her bones are stiff. Yeah. It's a rare disease affecting only by one, two people per million in, yeah, in common. Causes muscle stiffness. Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. Jason Sparkles, you remember Bruce Willis. Yeah, Bruce Willis, He's his health isn't doing good these days, uh, Jason. Bruce Willis, yeah. Bruce Willis. Yep. Yeah. When Wendy Williams has, a, oh, that's right too. She has the same condition, right? Wendy Williams. Yeah, that's right too. Yeah, that's right too. Yeah. I wonder what her boys look like today. Oh, uh, Renee Charles. Look at Renee, one of one of her sons. There's one of her sons there. That's Renee. That's Renee right there. Why is the lightning so bad? There he is. He kind of looks like his mother, doesn't he? Sparkles, he kind of looks like his mom. Yeah. Do you remember Sparkles and Kim from the 19? And Kim who? Sparkles. Oh, Sparkles and Kim from the 1994 Olympics. Mary Lou. Mary Lou. I do not. No, I don't remember that neither. No, Jason, I don't. Lisa, she got a brain cancer. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Jason. It's always sad, bad, bad health updates. Yeah, I know. It is, Sparkle. Yeah, it is. Yeah. How many sons does Celine Dion have? She has three sons. Renee Charles, 23. The twins are, oh, yeah, she had a set of twins, didn't she? She had a set of twins, guys. Nelson and Eddie, 13 years old. One of her sons died from a throat cancer. I didn't know one of her sons died. 
When is Celine's son dying? Renee, oh no. No, I don't think her son. How did Celine have, have her twins? My goodness. Oh, come on. I don't want that. Didn't, didn't she perform at the White House Celine Dion with Clinton? And they sang together in 1992 in the adoration. Oh, I can't remember, Jason. You lost me there. I can't remember, Jason. I wish I could. No, I can't remember that. Did she have three sons or what? Celine Dion, three children, three children's. She had three of them. A set of twins and a, and a little boy. Mm. Yeah, there's her family right there. That's all her boys. He's gone now, of course. She had three children. The twins and the other guy. Yeah. Hey, speaking of Bruce Willis, I just came by him, Jason. Look, there's Bruce Willis. Bruce Willis' wife, Emma, says they're stronger than ever before. Marks the 15th wedding anniversary. Without fright. Wasn't Celine Dion married to Michael J. Fox? No, no, no. No. She was married to her producer, Renee Charles. Renee passed away. No, not Michael J. Fox. No. He's married to someone else, Jason. He's married to someone else. Hey, look at this, guys. There's a way to look at the thing when the solar eclipse happens. Look. Look at how to photograph the eclipse without frying your phone. Look at that, guys. You got to put something over the top of it. Oh, I'm looking at this. Yeah. Space. Space, the final frontier. I love space stuff, astrology and all that. April the 21st, oh, that's in 2017.
The cruise ships will be coming in again, Jason. Every year we get cruise ships. Look at this. Look at that cruise. Look at that cruise ship. Oh, my God. They got everything on it. The Royal Caribbean. The Royal Caribbean. The cruise ships. I can't wait till the cruise ships come in again. I love it when they come in and dock down by the water. I go right down and take pictures and videos. It's fun, guys. I love it. I can't get over how long those cruise ships are. Oh, there's Willie Nelson. There's Willie Nelson, Jason. Five Hall of Fame worthy songs from John Anderson. Oh, no, that's John Anderson. That's not Willie Nelson. That's John Anderson. Jason, April the 8th. Yeah, the total eclipse, Jason. During the total eclipse, Doug. Oh, yeah, that Doug guy. Doug Bachelor. So you can wear Google or Google goggles. I said Google. <laughs> so you can wear goggles. Go goggles. If you have them from a ward two, ward two, and won't go blind. Doug Bachelor, you remember him? He goes to the yes, yeah, to the Bible study. Yes, Jason, I remember. I remember you talking about that. Yep. I remember. Okay, Sparkles. Thank you for coming in, dear. Big hearts for you. Hearts for you. Thank you for coming in. Have a good night. I will. I'm going to be saying goodbye for now, too, Jason. I think I'm going to end the show for now. Thank you, everyone, for your thumbs up. Thank you for everyone coming in. I appreciate you all. Have a good night, everyone. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. I love hearing from you all. Have a good night. Peace. Peace. Bye, Jason. Have a good night. Have a good one. Peace.